here. Good morning. Uh, Let's change. That's better. Huh? What was wrong with you? You want to draw? I thought you were going to help me make a smoothie. Oh, smoothie. Why do you want to make a smoothie? Yeah. 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 Take all this. Yeah, I'm doing that. Okay, you get the spoon. Hold on. Yeah, but then you're gonna get it on you're getting it on the sides. Okay, ready? You're gonna spin it. <laughs> Is it yummy? Oh, you want some smoothie too? Smoothie. Oh wait, why at first and then you have some after? That is not. That is not. Wait, why it? I mean, wait, London. Just a second. <laughs> what? <laughs> you know, you're not eating that for breakfast. Go, go eat your breakfast first. Eat your eggs. Hi everyone, and welcome back to our channel. For those new here, hi, I'm Dr. Jenny Lay. I'm a family medicine physician and a mom of two. Today is our first day of Vlogmas. Um, if you guys have been watching any sort of news media, you would have heard that there's a new variant, also known as B11529. Um, they're calling it Omicron and it was originated in Europe. They were able to isolate the virus and they noted that it was just community spread. It wasn't from other nations or countries. Um, I know it was also isolated in South Africa. So the more people that this coronavirus is spreading to and mutating, we will likely see it come to the United States. <laughs> it's never gonna be normal. So as of right now, the CDC recommends everybody get a booster if you've been past six months from your original dose series. And Stan got his booster yesterday. So how are you feeling, Dad? Uh, arms really sore. Did you do quick shots? Yeah. Oh, and your arms still short, sore from the shot or from the exercise? From the shot, I think. Okay. Uh, and then what else? I have a headache and a sore throat. Oh. It doesn't feel terrible. So I think you should take it, medicine. It's bearable. I took aspirin already. This one. Yeah, yeah. Tylenol. Yeah. So a thousand milligrams of Tylenol. So Stan ended up getting Pfizer. He had Pfizer for his original two doses. He didn't want to, or he didn't. He didn't know that he could mix. Um, it wasn't offered to him when he went to Costco to get his booster shot. So I personally would have tried to get the Moderna vaccine. So the CDC says that the Omicron variant is of concern is because there are mutations within the spike protein itself, but they also said that vaccines are still effective. So the further you are out from either infection, creating immunity, infection mediated immunity, or a vaccination, you are more likely to become more ill or require hospitalization, or if you ha just haven't been vaccinated at all, then you're more at risk of severe disease if you get Omicron. So 
that is our concern right now of everything that is going on. So yeah, um, I'm going to get it to work out. So it is my lunchtime now and I just have some thoughts, you know, so I'm going to share my thoughts with you guys. Nobody asked, but you know, it's vlogmas. So anyways, um, I'm very confused when people say that they try to boost, boost their immune system with supplements. Like, I don't understand how that works, to be honest. It's kind of like saying, I'm going to grow huge muscles by taking a protein shake. <laughs> That's not how it works. You build muscle by continuing to progressively overload, by exercising, exposing your body to weightlifting exercises, right? And you progress the better you get and the stronger you get. Same thing with mental health, like anxiety or trauma. You can't deal with all the anxiety and trauma at once, but if you're able to deal with it in smaller increments, potentially you'll be able to build up a tolerance to deal with it more over time. You can only do that when you're in feeling in a safe place, um, but it's like exposure therapy, right? Same thing with a vaccine. So the only way you're able to boost your immune system for it to prime itself is if you expose yourself to either a weakened virus or a small part of the virus. And that is what vaccines are. You could potentially get sick with the real virus and either die or have severe illness or have long COVID. But why would you want to do that when there are other options where you can literally train your body, boost your immune system so that it can protect itself when it's up against the real thing. And so now what they're seeing is that with a new infection or boost, you would see increase in neutralizing antibodies. So our immune systems are really complex. And so they found that that initial boost will help with protecting you against the variants. But the best way for us to get out of this really is together. Like it's either everyone has to get infected at the same time so that the virus can't spread, but that would lead to a lot of death and a lot of long COVID and just not enough resources. And so lots of bad things can happen or we can all be vaccinated at the same time. And so the virus will just not spread. If we kill it, if we, if we starve it of its food source of its home, then it just, it has nowhere to go and it will just die <laughs> right um but i don't understand why we can't all come together like it just like baffles me i also don't get this theory that pharmaceutical companies are trying to make money off this vaccine because they make money when people are sick they make a ton more money when people are sick and have long covid because they depend on medications to for them to live every single day not just a vaccine once a year or like four doses total forever. Secondly, it's kind of like having long COVID when you have an autoimmune response, your body is attacking itself and you need to take prednisone forever. It's going to cost a lot more money to take prednisone forever, along with all the other health risks of taking prednisone forever, like osteoporosis, breaking bones, um, depression, anxiety, all those other things that require health cost, increased health costs. Yeah, it's just... I don't get it. Hey, mom, I want a water tofu. What you? I want that. Oh, yeah. A lot of asparagus? A lot of rice. Oh, yeah, a lot of rice. Yeah. Please, I want to eat it. Okay, after you finish yours. And then we can finish ours. Huh? I want mommy. Oh, you want mommy? Here, I'll sit over here then. Mommy, Ugh. mommy. Okay, sit down. I want to sit. No, I want to sit here. Okay, how am I supposed to eat then? I want rice. Oh, you want rice? Yeah. How about you eat some tofu? No, that was mine. I need eat my other tofu. You know what? You need the soup. Why it? And now I need to do rice. 
Yeah. There's no rice in there. You want mommy to get you more rice? I can get you more rice. Oh, I do with mommy. Okay, sit down. Oh, my God. Hey, what? What? How can I buy? Daddy took it so he could get you some. Alright, it's been way past 24 hours since you had your vaccine. How do you feel? I feel pretty good. I saw like 95%. Oh, huh. I'm kind of just drowsy. But other than that, I don't have a headache. Nothing? No. You're all better? Yep. Already? Not even arm soreness? Nope. No bruising? No. Nope. Well, I don't think so. <laughs> no, no bruise. <laughs> just white arm. That one is pepper. It's spicy mayo. What? Try it. Why? Try it. <laughs> it's not spicy. Yeah, it's not spicy. It's yummy. Okay, go ahead, eat it. Mom? Oh, it's yummy. <laughs> Mom? Yummy. Yes, honey. Wait, where's Wendon's asparagus? Oh, oh, who likes my? Is it spicy? Uh, I think so. <laughs> Thank you, mommy. You think so? It's a little spicy? Here, drink your juice. Yeah. All right, guys. So that is all. Um, as I said, you know, the only way we're going to get out of this pandemic is if we do it together. And... I don't know when that's gonna happen. Hopefully it'll just be like the flu eventually, um, but I'm trying to get back to my real life here. <laughs> I'm trying to go back to traveling and all that stuff. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna put up our Christmas tree now. Merry Christmas, have fun. <laughs> my Christmas tree. Yeah. I, I love my Christmas tree. Yeah, you love it? I love the top. Yeah, one second when we it's turn it on. It's a star. Mom, look at this. Wow, what is I, that? It's a, it's a, a bright, nice silver one. Mm -hmm. oh, Dad, why are you bumping <laughs> me with your, your butt face? Wow. wow. Thank you.